First tonight, some developing news in a story we've been tracking for a week now. Early this morning, just before 4 o'clock, there was a robbery at the Dunkin' Donuts on Reservoir Avenue in Cranston. Well, the suspect description matches that of recent armed robberies in Cranston. Tonight, police say they've made an arrest and that the suspect could be responsible for other recent robberies. Eyewitness News reporter Eric Halpern just got an update from police and joins us from Cranston. Cranston police have a suspect in custody they believe to be responsible for a handful of local robberies. Police tell me the suspect's name is not yet being released because investigators are still working through a lot of the details. Over the past few weeks, several Cranston businesses have fallen victim to armed robberies. A suspect was caught on surveillance video at an Elmwood Ave mobile station last weekend. He goes into the store holding out a gun, demanding money while wearing a dark sweatshirt with his face covered. Police say a similar tactic was used at other robberies around the city starting back on May 24th. In the time span up until an arrest was made around 4 Saturday morning, a shell station on Narragansett Boulevard was hit twice. A 7-Eleven on Reservoir Ave was also hit twice. That's in addition to the mobile station robbery police gave us surveillance video of. Hundreds of dollars were taken throughout all the incidents, but no one was hurt. Again, investigators are still going through all the information related to all these robberies. Cranston police have said that it's possible this suspect is responsible for a couple robberies in Providence. In Cranston, I'm Eric Halpern, Eyewitness News.